Happy birthday, happy 15 years anniversary. And I'm here today to answer the question of somebody. When pruning a bonsai, it is important to also prune roots by equal amounts. What happens if over time I don't repot the tree and never trim some roots? There's both very interesting question. To begin, if he has to be in an equal amount, he will never be in an equal amount because the repotting will happen only on a young tree um, every three to four years or maybe two years old depends because the growth of the roots depends on the growth of the trees if you have a tree they grow a lot uh, its branches then you will have also uh, roots they will grow a lot if you need to um, let your tree grow because he needs to get more strength he needs to be uh, stronger then you need to let the roots grow at the same time but when you will happen to be at the point when the trees grows a lot roots will also grow a lot then you will face a problem that you will have no space in your pots then the roots won't be able to grow again and more <clears throat> then you will have a problem in uh, the growing of your tree now, for that reason, you need to prune uh, the roots because in bonsai, we need it's the, the small roots. We need the roots to feed the trees. We don't need the big roots, the big roots into the soil because that in the nature, it's the roots that will maintain the stability of the tree in the ground. But there is no use for feeding the tree. So what you will have to do is repot the tree, of course, probably if it's a young tree, every minimum two years, could be three to four, all depends the growth of your tree. Then you will have to repot the tree, you will have to select the roots, take the bigger roots out and uh, increase the maximum space to let the small roots grow. That would be uh, very important to begin with. We could talk about the mature tree, where it'd be a little bit different, but I don't think that's really your question. But if the tree was really mature, and you don't want the growth to be as strong as it is now, then you would repot uh, less the tree. You would keep the tree in a more compact soil for a longer time. In this case, you would reduce the size of the growth, the size of ramification, the size of leaves, many other aspects but i think your question it's more when you begin when you begin with a tree that will be in training then yes the trees has to develop and he has to grow and also the roots uh, will grow a lot then you need uh, to report to answer your question the reporting aspect is very important to keep the health of your tree and to keep the uh, the balance between the roots and the growth of the branches. So you will have to report, you have to keep in mind too, then the, when you trim the roots, it's not a um, very often activity, it's only each time that you report, then you will have to think about uh, constricting the nibari at the same time. That's also something very important. That's where you would keep the stronger roots. That's where you would need maybe to orient it, the roots in the direction to construct the nebari correctly. That's also an important uh, uh, thing to do when you're reporting your tree. I think uh, we could talk uh, for a lot longer on this aspect of reporting because reporting is uh, one of the most important action that you can do in bonsai to keep the bonsai healthy. I hope I answer your question correctly. Hope I give you the advice you need. Thank you for your question and uh, hope uh, we'll have uh, other questions later to answer. Thanks everybody.